President Putin, and mm -hmm. this is a big, serious, I guess, video call that the two of them are having. Sorry, 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 sorry. Yes, this will be tomorrow, Tuesday, over video call, so we'll get to see each other. Certainly important for the dynamics here. The President said this should be a real conversation. There's a lot on the table, but of course the big one is Ukraine. And the one who said that the President will reaffirm the U.S. support for the sovereignty and territory. Yeah, it's right, uh, it's as it, uh, Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> The question is, is that enough to deter him right All now? right, all right, Paul. Thank you so much. I appreciate your time. Have a great day. All right, you too. See you later. All right, all yeah. Right. Sorry, Paul. I hope that conversation goes well. That's all. Right. All right. Sorry, yeah. Sorry, Paul. 24 hour newsroom. So, as you know, CNN fired anchor Chris Cuomo over the weekend. Sorry, there is another accuser coming down, something like that, I'm paraphrasing. But that's, that's essentially yeah. what the back and forth is. And that comes after yeah, that's 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 Hey, I'm not going to, you know, cover my brother's story, I'm too close to it, that kind of thing, I'm not going to participate in it. Well, I think we'll do a little participation, right? So, here's the thing though. CNN fires him oh, over the weekend. The next day, I think they yeah, actually fired him Saturday. The next day it comes wow. out that Chris Cuomo himself mm -hmm. had been accused of sexual misconduct mm -hmm. by well, a former colleague. Now here's the thing. CNN mm -hmm. is saying okay. that it talked to its lawyers about what Chris Cuomo did regarding his brother. Mm -hmm. And that that was what there was, you know, uh, Chris Cuomo was in violation of whatever their policies are, yes, or yes. just in violation period. And they were able to fire him just on that. However, according to the attorney of this woman who's come forward with these sexual misconduct allegations, these allegations came down on Wednesday. So Chris Cuomo is suspended on Tuesday. The allegations from the woman come on Wednesday. And he's fired on Saturday. And the question now is, did the allegations from this woman play into CNN's decision to let Chris Cuomo go. If it had just been what he did regarding his brother, would he still be around? Or, if you think what he did with his brother and the allegations from this woman, and they said, Chris Cuomo is way too much of a liability around here. Let's get him out. That's something that uh, may or may not come out, but bottom line is, Chris Cuomo is out. He's got other allegations against him. So just because he was fired, that doesn't stop this other woman. Oh, so, uh, yeah, we'll see what happens there. All right, are you ready to meet Leonard? Because I'm not. Leonard apparently is going to make a stop near Earth on December 12th. And Leonard, as far as I'm concerned, you just keep going. Leonard is a comet. So He's also known as 2021 I like Comet Leonard better. It will make its closest approach to Earth on December 12th, according to NASA. The comet was discovered earlier this year by an astronomer named Gregory Leonard, so Tuesday. You know, that's the way to get yourself a comet. you got to find one, and then you can name it after yourself. Hey, Josh. Very simple. Leonard is actually already visible in the sky, and he can be seen the first two weeks of December in the hey, east before the sun rises. So NASA says you can spot it by looking between the Big Dipper's handle, and Arctic? Sure. The latter of which is the brightest of the stars in the night sky. So it's right, it's right, yeah. Then, it's as it is. We get closest encounter with our planet on December 12th. Then the comet will be visible in the...